One way to render and export movies from After Effects is to use Adobe Media Encoder. If I go to File, Add After Effects Composition, I can navigate to an After Effects Composition. and choose which composition to import from it. I'll choose Future Section Final. And then that composition is added to the encoding queue for Adobe Media Encoder. I can apply an encoding preset by going to the presets here and doing a search. Let's say that I want to output this to Vimeo. using the Vimeo HD preset at 25 frames per second for European standards. I can drag this on to the existing preset, and it's replaced. I can also add an item for an iPad. I'll use this iPad preset here, double-click on it to add it to the list. And let's say that I also want a version for my Android device. I can browse to it. I'll use this one. I can just drag it over here. And once I've got my various output types set up, I can just click Start Queue. And here, in the encoding panel, I see a preview as the encoding proceeds. Notice that Adobe Media Encoder can encode multiple items simultaneously. It can encode multiple items from a single composition or a single item in the encoding queue to various outputs all at once. Another option, instead of adding compositions manually to Adobe Media Encoder, is to use a watch folder. A workflow that I often use from After Effects is to use the render queue to render and export a master, which is a losslessly compressed master, and have that drop into a folder of a known destination. And I put that folder here in the watch folders. So to add a watch folder, you just click the plus sign here, navigate to the directory that you want for Adobe Media Encoder to watch, and then click OK. I'll click Cancel here, because I don't actually want to add one right now. And then once Adobe Media Encoder sees an item show up in the Watch folder, it will encode it into the preset that you've dictated down here. If you need to pause or stop encoding at any point, you can use the Stop and Pause buttons. So Adobe Media Encoder is a convenient way to render and export from After Effects, especially if what you need to do is encode to specific devices because Adobe Media Encoder has a very convenient way of browsing for encoding presets for all of those various devices and web services.